Dakota Sushama Pioneer Survival Company. Today I'm with Captain Joseph Dow of the 5th Infantry of Virginia. Every time we go into the outdoors in the bushcraft community, we're carrying haversacks, bedrolls, and such. But that's a modern day look that we usually take on it. Today, he is going to discuss how they used to do it back in the Civil War. So, when the soldiers signed on for the American Civil War, they were expected to carry all of their gear with them. And what most of them were issued is what we have here. And this is called a knapsack. Now the knapsack was designed to carry all the soldiers' bedding, his camping equipment, and all of his personal possessions. Now a knapsack fully packed could have weighed upwards of 20 to 25 pounds. And that is a massive hindrance on the soldier when they're expected to march 12 to 20 miles a day. So many soldiers got around this and they implemented the use of the blanket roll. Now the blanket roll was a very simple, simple thing. It was just simply a blanket with your personal possessions, such as your extra socks, maybe a pair of drawers, wrapped up inside, and then slung around your shoulders like so. And it would still allow you to fire your weapon and do all the necessities of a soldier. Now, knapsacks were often dropped before battle at the beginning of the war because they didn't want them to weigh their soldiers down. But unfortunately, as the war went on, that became less and less possible due to the fact that the battles were taking the soldiers miles from where they started. So the blanket roll allowed them to still carry their gear, but also be light and effective. Now, the other thing that soldiers would have used to carry their items would have been what's known as the haversack. The haversack was a simple cloth bag, like so, and would have been worn on the left hip and suspended from the shoulder. Now the haversack would have contained a soldier's eating utensils and his food. And we must remember, disease was the chief killer of the American Civil War, taking two for everyone who died of battle wounds. And this haversack is what all of your food was in for years at a time and hardly getting washed. Besides that, a soldier might carry his tobacco in there. He might carry uh, his personal letters and his money, anything that needs to be within easy reach. But primarily this was for food and food only. And put that all together and you get a very efficient and lightweight soldier for the American Civil War.